Hello, how to solve for A and B in this equation A plus B is equal to 25, AB is equal to 100 solution. A plus B is equal to 25, let's call this equation 1. Then AB is equal to 100, let's call this equation 2. Now from equation 1, A plus B is equal to 25, B is equal to 25 minus A, let's call this equation 3. Also from equation 2, AB is equal to 100. Then we can now substitute for B. We have A bracket 25 minus A is equal to 100. Then here we have A multiplied by 25. This is 25A minus a multiplied by a a square is equal to 100 then this is 25 a minus a square minus 100 is equal to zero then here is minus a square plus 25 a minus 100 is equal to 0. Let's divide all through by minus 1. Minus a squared divided by minus 1. This is a square plus 25a divided by minus 1. This is minus 25a minus 100 divided by minus 1. This is plus... 100 is equal to 0. This is a quadratic equation. Let's solve this using quadratic general formula. A is equal to minus B plus or minus square root of B square minus 4AC then over 2A. From this equation, a is equal to 1, B is equal to minus 25, C is equal to 100. Therefore, A is equal to minus bracket minus 25 plus or minus square root of minus 25 square minus 4 multiplied by 1 multiplied by c is 100 everything divided by 2 multiplied by 1 a is equal to minus times minus 25 this is 25 plus or minus square root of minus 25 square that is c is 25 minus 4 multiplied by 1 multiplied by 100 that is 400 everything divided by 2 multiplied by 1 that is 2 A is equal to 25 plus or minus square root of 625 minus 400, that is 225. Then everything divided by 2. But square root of 225. 
is equal to 15. Then this can be written as A is equal to 25 plus or minus square root of 15 square. This cancel this. We know everything is divided by 2. This is 25 plus or minus 15 divided by 2. Then A is equal to 25 plus 15 divided by 2 or 25 minus 15 divided by 2. A is equal to 25 plus 15, that is 40, divided by 2, or A is equal to 25 minus 15, that is 10, divided by 2, 2 here, 1, 2 here, 5, then 2 here, 1, 2 here, 20, therefore, a1 is equal to 20 and A2 is equal to 5. We've gotten the values of A. Let's solve for B. To solve for B, then from equation 3, B is equal to 25 minus A. Then B1 is equal to 25 minus A1. And of course, A1 is equal to 20. B1 is equal to 25 minus 20. B1 is equal to 5. This is the value of B1. Also, B2 is equal to 25 minus A2. And then, B2 is equal to 25 minus A2 is 5. B2 is equal to 25 minus 5. This is 20. And this is the value of B2. Therefore, our final answer are A1, comma B1 is equal to 20, comma 5. And then a2 comma b2 is equal to 5 comma 20. This had the final answer. You can see that the value of a1 here is equal to the value of b2 here. And the value of b1 here is equal to the value of a2 here. I hope you enjoyed this video. Thank you for watching. Please don't forget to like, share, comment and subscribe to my channel. Bye.